Oh my god. He's Steven. And she's Andy. And today we're at Horseshoe Bend. At the end of 2020, we decided to pack up our lives, leave our beloved Los Angeles, and drive across the country to ride out the rest of the pandemic with family on the East Coast. Even though the journey was quick, we managed to make a few fun stops along the way to take in some U.S. history and natural wonders. When you last saw us, we were at the south rim of the Grand Canyon. Today we're at the east rim near Page, Arizona to see Horseshoe Bend, a vibrant and dramatic U-shaped meander of the Colorado River. So we deviated from our eastbound path because we had to come up here and see this. Yeah, there was no way we could go through northern Arizona without coming up to Page and seeing Horseshoe Bend. And it does not disappoint. Oh, man. The walk to the bend from the parking lot is a little more than half a mile, with a bit of an incline at the beginning. But we didn't find it too strenuous, and the recently added paths and covered pit stops make it a pleasant hike. I don't know if it's coming out on video, but these rock formations are really cool. They kind of remind me of the pancake rocks that were on a Danger and Stacy video when they were touring New Zealand this summer. I don't know if the color is translating in the camera, but I really hope it is because it's just stunning. Okay, we didn't get to use our America the Beautiful Pass today because it's completely free to get in here. How awesome is that? There is a parking fee, however, and that's for everybody. Uh, for us with a regular vehicle, it was $10. And at the gate, the guy saw that we had a dog in the back of the car, so he gave us a dog treat. How cool. If you saw our 40 questions challenge video, you might remember that Steven's afraid of heights. I think he's doing okay today, considering that it's so worth it. So this is a short one today because this is all there is here. It's really easy to get to. It's great to walk around, lots of beautiful vantage points. And uh, well, now we're gonna go back to the hotel and give these guys a break from all the long car rides and excitement. Come on, bud. Because it's just unbelievable. It was totally worth the trip, yeah. We were about two hours north now of where we should be, so we're gonna have to head another two hours south and then jump back on the 40 to go east. But completely worth it. So worth it. Yeah, and it uh, feels a lot safer than some other parts of Arizona that we've been in as far as people wearing masks, social distancing, and things like that. Yeah, highly recommended. If you're anywhere within a couple hours and you're debating, definitely come here. Absolutely. So as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. Tune in next week. We're going to be in Texas in our next stop, so hopefully we'll find some cool stuff there to show you. I can't imagine we wouldn't. Oh, yeah. And uh, we'll see you next see time. See you next time. You just said I East. Say east. <laughs> I did not. There's no way I said East. You think I'm Paul Stanley? We deviated from our eastbound path because we just had to make a pit stop here. That doesn't I'm make sense. What? I didn't say I'm sorry. Stop. You didn't, but I started laughing. America, the beautiful. Blech. Beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> no way we could go through northern Arizona without coming up to paint and clogging our <laughs> sunglasses. <laughs> <laughs> And not come up to Page to see the Horseshoe Canyon. And Horse it does not... Oh, Horseshoe Bend? <laughs>